What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about Bio Nano Genomics, ticker symbol BNGO. This stock has been on an absolutely insane run over the past couple of weeks. In the last week alone, it is up about 50%, which is absolutely amazing. If you guys have gotten into this company early, congratulations on your gains. I think this is just the beginning for this company. We're going to go over all of the different reasons why Bio Nano Genomics has gone up so much in the past week and the reason why it had such a steep fall yesterday and what we can expect from Bio Nano Genomics in the near future. So if you guys enjoy this video, please go down and hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. It really helps me get this information out to as many people as possible and it helps me grow on this platform. You get to stay up to date on all of your favorite stocks and learn about a couple of new ones as well. Now, before we get into some of the uh, different reasons why Bio Nano Genomics has gone up so much and had a steep uh, drop yesterday. Let's take a look at a very interesting options play that I am looking at getting into for Bio Nano Genomics. So if we come over here, we can see that this is the August 20th, 2021 expiration date. And I am looking at in the money uh, contract. So I don't usually do this. Um, this is something that's a little bit different from my typical trading strategies. But when the option chain is this new, you can sometimes find a couple of strikes on the options chains that are not priced correctly uh, or they're priced uh, very well for options buyers. And let's take a look at one of those that I am looking at right now. So this $2 in the money contract, the ask is about $6.90. That means that if you were to go up to the ask and buy this contract for $690, your break-even price would be $690 plus two, which is the strike, which means that your break-even for this trade would be BioNanogenomics going up to $8.90. That's pretty insane. BioNanogenomics does not have to go up that much by August for you to break even on this trade. But since these are deep in the money contracts, it's most likely you're going to have to exercise uh, and purchase the 100 shares per contract of the stock, which I'm thinking that BioNanogenomics could get all the way up to the 15 dollar mark by august and if it does and you own these contracts you own the right to buy 100 shares per contract at two dollars so you would be paying 200 dollars for a position that would be worth 1500 dollars. that's a pretty insane uh bet Yesterday, Bio Nano Genomics had a pretty terrible day, and the reason for that was that they announced another uh, underwritten public offering, and this is going to be in the amount of about $200 million. They're offering about 333 million shares at a price of $6 per share. Now, if we go back to the chart, we can see that Bio Nano was trading at the $9 mark when they came out with this news, and it fell all the way to the $7.80 mark. But as I've said before, when Bio Nano re uh, releases these offerings, we usually see this pretty steep sell-off and then a pretty sharp bounce the next day because investors uh, are pretty excited about what bio nanogenomics is going to be using these funds for if we go back to their previous offering we can see that bio nanogenomics was trading at around the five dollar mark they announced their uh, share offering at about three dollars and five cents bio nano fell down all the way to the low fours and then the next couple of days it absolutely ripped up before having a sell-off so basically what i'm thinking that they're going to be using uh these funds for is the exact same thing that we've seen in all of the other public offerings it's going to be general corporate purposes in uh, pursuing strategic opportunities for combining with another business or acquiring another business in order to streamline the production and distribution of their sapphire product now this sapphire product is actually pretty insane Insane. It's the only product on the market that can do uh, the genome mapping like it does. It's super cost effective and more effective at what it does. Now, if we take a look over here, I think Bio Nano Genomics is going to have a short squeeze in the recent, uh, in the near future. So if we come over here, we can see that 8.4 million shares are sold short right now, and the dollar volume of this is about 48 million. Now. If Bio Nano Genomics keeps going up on this uptrend, we're gonna have to we're gonna see a lot of these shorts have to cover their position because when you short sell a stock, you're selling shares that you do not own in the hopes to buy the stock back at a lower price than what you sold it for. 
But if we see the stock continue up on this very steep uptrend, we're going to see the shorts have to cover, uh, which means they're going to have to buy the stock back at a higher price than what they paid, and they're going to take a pretty significant loss on this trade. So I think that we could see this squeeze happen in the next couple of weeks. I think BioNanoGenomics could get up to the $12 mark by the end of January, so make sure you're looking out for that. They just also recently had their BioNanoGenomics Cytogenomics Symposium, and and one of the most important things that they released was that they identified structural variants with possible roles in pathogenesis and outcomes in severely ill patients using the BioNano Sapphire system. Now, we've also seen that Biden has requested a $415 million package. And in that package, he mentions the word genomics and genome mapping a lot. So I think it's safe to say that BioNanogenomics could get a government contract in the near future. And if they do, this stock is going to go absolutely insane. Uh, just like we saw with Palantir, every single time they get a big government contract, like when they were a part of Operation Warp Speed, the stock went absolutely absolutely crazy in the uh, days and weeks following that announcement. Another thing that's interesting to note, if we take a look at the recent 13F filings of uh, these companies, we can see that Vanguard has a $5.5 million position in BioNanogenomics right now, but these numbers are slightly delayed. These were last quarter's 13F uh, filings, and the 13F filings for uh, the fourth quarter of 2020 are starting to trickle in throughout February uh, and January. So I think we're going to see Vanguard up their position. If we scroll down a little bit more, we can see that UBS has a position. It's a pretty small position. JP Morgan Chase has a position. Uh, BNY Mellon also has a position, Citadel, Wedbush. Uh, there's a lot of companies on here that do have small positions in bio-nanogenomics, especially the Royal Bank of Canada. I think we're going to see these share amounts go up a lot in the near future, especially when these uh, 13F filings get released. Now, you can track these on your own on whalewisdom.com. I'm not affiliated with this company in any form. It's just a helpful tool to track and see what these different institutions are holding on their uh uh, in their portfolio. So I also think we are going to see ARK Invest buy. Um, so Kathy Wood has said a lot about their uh, genomics and that she thinks that that's the future. And there was a YouTube video posted that an individual had an interview with an ARK analyst um, and they originally said that they were not going to go anywhere near bio nanogenomics, but that uh, statement has recently been retracted. And uh, the analyst said that his statements were taken out of context. So I think there's a good possibility that bio nanogenomics could become a part of one of ARC's ETFs in the near future. If ARC buys into BNGO, the stock is going to go crazy. Now, it was previously like a typical biotech penny stock. It had a 180-day uh, compliance extension by NASDAQ to get up to $1. And BioNanogenomics said that if they were not able to uh, reach that share price, that they would perform a reverse split, which is usually very bad for a company. But when they released their study on uh, their autism study, where they uh, genome mapped and sequenced uh, Professor Grandin's uh, genome, they found a lot of interesting things. They're looking to try uh, to create better health outcomes for people uh, on the autism spectrum. I think we're going to see bio nanogenomics a lot more in the news, especially with their Sapphire system. Uh, not only will bio nanogenomics be in the, the news, but their Sapphire system will be because they're selling it and licensing it to other people to use it. So in conclusion, I think that bio nanogenomics is a great uh, opportunity right now and a great add to your portfolio. Uh, I think that these uh, in the money calls are actually one of the best options that you can go with right now. You're you're paying a pretty significant premium, but the break-even price is so close to what BioNanogenomics is currently trading at right now, and there's enough time on the option chain. I would prefer that these would be January 22 or January 23, but these contracts would be probably in the two to four thousand dollar range if uh they were they were out that far for that expiration but i think august is a solid expiration date to get into that's that's like seven eight months from now um so i think if you get into these positions you just got to hold them in the hopes that bio nanogenomics breaks above uh the eight dollar nine eight dollar ninety nine dollar mark and then you'll be able to exercise 
uh, this these contracts and buy 100 shares of Biogen, BioNano Genomics at the $2 price point. So that's going to be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed what I had for you in this one, please go down and hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. It really helps me get this information out to as many people as possible. You get to stay up to date on all of your favorite stocks, learn about a couple of new ones and see what options and trades that I am taking. So I hope you guys are having a very profitable day and I'll see you guys in the next video.